All you need to do is go to wix.com and it's gonna ask you to sign up and it's free, just put your information and your email address in. And then once you do that, this will be what you'll be looking at. So this is my account and I actually happen to have one website here. So all the websites you create will be down here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna create a new site. So then you click right here where it says create new site. Okay. And then what kind of website do you wanna create? Well, we're designing a restaurant. So we're gonna to wanna to click on restaurant and food right here. All right. And then it says choose how you wanna create your website. We want to create our own website. So you'll come down here to the right, choose a template. All right, so then it gives you an array of tons of different options. So we wanna break it down a little bit because it can get overwhelming because there's so many different templates. We're doing a restaurant. So you don't have to worry about catering, um, cafe, bakery, bars, or clubs. Go ahead and just click on restaurant. So then it allows you to scroll through all the different restaurant templates right here. So as you're looking, it depends on what your concept is. So if you have a fine dining, you're gonna to wanna to kind of look at more of a template that has fine dining. So for example, this one looks a little classic. So you wanna click on a view. You don't wanna click on edit yet because you wanna just take a look at it. Now it kind of shows you the website um, and it actually just shows you like a picture of it. Now in order to view the whole entire site, go ahead and click on full, full view, full demo. And then that way you can kind of scroll through the site and kind of, kind of take a look at it. So like, hmm, this is the kind of one I want. You can click on the different areas. They have restaurant, they have their menu. And you're like, oh, well, I don't know. Maybe, maybe not this one. Then you can come out of it and click on a different one. Now, for instance, if you want to say, you know what? I like this one. I'm gonna go ahead and use this, use this one. You go ahead and click right here where it says edit this site. So then it'll bring you to the screen where you can edit and create your own website. All right, it's loading. So just give it a second. Okay, so I'm gonna move this over um, a little bit so you guys can kind of see the web page area. Okay, so this you're in edit mode right now. So this is gonna be your home. Now you can always change the background picture. If you just click on it, it'll say change page background. So once you change that, it'll let you change the, the background of the picture so you can upload whatever picture you want of your choice, okay? So now we have all of our categories. So remember I was talking about, you make sure you're gonna want an events page, social media, restaurant, and menu. Now, some of these already have them built in there but the thing is, okay, like for instance, menu. If you click on menu, navigate. You want to navigate to menu. It kind of has it pre-done in there for you already. So you can do that, but I really want you to use the tool Canva or the um, other sites for creating menu that I have written in the assignment category. And so it has all these boxes. And so it gets kind of complicated trying to fix that. So all you need to do is you want to get rid of this. So you'll go right here to menu and pages. And then you want to delete it. So click on this icon right here and hit delete. Delete. So then it gives you a fresh page already. Now you want to add a page. So you're just going to write it in there again. You want to do events. We're in events and then you want to add the picture of the events you've already chosen you go here to add you want to click on image my image uploads upload media upload from computer and click on one of the events you um like for instance this one right here There you go there's one of your events and then like i said for the instructions you i want you to have three events so then you'll just go back here add again add media all right and then next is the social media so 
menus and pages, you want to go home. Now for the social media, if you, you can either choose Instagram, Facebook, it doesn't matter. You go here and you'll go down to social. Now you're going to have to click on the social bar. And then when you go to get social links, it lets you delete all of them. So if you're going to do Facebook, go ahead and get rid of all these. Just delete, 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 delete. And then it gives you the option to type in the Facebook um, restaurant page you created. And then you'll hit done. And then done. And then you can kind of move around however you want to put it. Okay. Now for describing the restaurant, you can create your own tab. You can go back here to menus and pages. Uh, you can delete one of these and then just put or leave it restaurant, delete restaurant, and then add your own page and then just type in how you want that. Now for describing the menu, it's going to be the same way as you did the events page. OK, um, you know, you'll say order online. OK, manage menu. You'll delete that one. Why not? We want to delete it. OK, and then you want to create another page. And then you want to name it menu because this is where your menu is going to be. I have a blank page and then you'll add it just like you did with the events. You'll go to image. Uploads, upload media, upload from computer. the page there you go there's your menu now when you're done with everything you always want to hit save it'll give you the actual name of the website okay so you want to record that save and continue and then done and then you can publish it and when you publish it that means it's complete and then you can copy and paste that and you can actually go and view the site so this will be the actual site here so here's your events. All right. If you have any questions, just go ahead and let me know. Email me. And so this is, but make sure you do take a look at the blog. So you make sure that you guys are getting all the things done before you actually do the website. All right. Y'all have fun.